actually looked like an animal busy walking into the bush here. Obviously the first thing that caught my attention on coming closer to it, I'm going to have a careful look in first, make sure there's nothing in there. Doesn't look like it at the moment. Big hole down here. If you look closer in, unfortunately you won't be able to. The slope down here, sand is all sort of nice and broken up. So something is walking down here. Um, and then the inside here, if you look at this part here, it's quite dark at the moment. Tunnel's still running around. You can just from the see that me Okay, now probably this Sorry guys, the signal went a bit odd there, we're a little bit far away from camp at the moment. Just to get back here, like I said, something must have broken this open. Just from the natural shape of this termite mound, it would have started here. Most of this tree trunk would have been incorporated into it. So, quite a few guesses as to what it was. Maybe an artifact, they sometimes dig in here. Uh, could have been a honey badger. Honey badgers are very, very good at digging. They've even broken off the top area here. To be very honest with you, I can have a few guesses at what it was, but what actually did it, I can't tell you for sure. Maybe if we came here days or two after it happened, we would have been able to see. But this gives you a nice idea of the shape of the termite mine. You can see all these tunnels, ventilation shafts in here. And you can nice and easily imagine how many things could live in here. Everything from reptiles, snakes, lizards, little insects, up to different kinds of mammals. The termites down here, though. This is just the tip sticking out, probably about... 80 or 90% of the termite activity will actually be underground here. Yeah.